Have you ever started doing something only to suddenly realize you need to quickly do something else? I did. Right before I started recording. Only to start recording anyway. Oh, it's down below. Who the hell is this? Quick, follow me! Trust a stranger? I'm no stranger. I'm El Peace. And I've been watching you. That's not ominous at all. And now we go into a cutscene. Drop the cloak and dagger. I've been training to become like you, but training isn't enough. You're more than a warrior. The blood of the gods runs through your veins. I thought they preferred Isu in Atlantis. The Isu may as well be the divine with how they rule. Cold, calculating, indifferent to the people milling beneath them. But it's not just Isu blood that makes you special, is it? There's something else. Well, you tell me. I'm talking about this. Your spear. Ooh, you can actually hit on her. <laughs> spear. Uh, that's pretty funny. Excuse me, I'm just scrolling up. Scrolling, 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 reaching the top. Showing off for me, are you? Just a little. <laughs> are you impressed? If I wasn't so distracted by your beautiful face, you would never have gotten close to my spear. Flattering, but we have business to attend to, the Castis. So, what do you want from me? I'm involved with Atlas. He's afraid of taking the relationship public. He says his enemies would exploit me as his weakness, so he keeps me a secret. Wait, you're in love with Atlas? From my experience, I'm not sure Isu men truly love. Nevertheless, I need to make him see that I can be his strength. Our partnership might be a key to bridging the gap between Isu and humans. Your love is strategic. If we take the relationship public, we could marry and I could rule the district by his side, influence policy and ease the tension between the two groups. But so long as I am merely human, it can never be. That's why I want to be like you. You seem very passionate about Atlantean politics. Atlas doesn't approach the human and Isu conflict with compassion for humanity. I believe I can bring that compassion. It would be nice to have another ally in Atlantis. What's your plan? At the Adamant Metalon, they harvest a metal used to create devices just like your spear. My spear is the strongest metal ever forged. Could this be used to forge other weapons? Well... Adamant ingots could, but what I need is raw adamant. I know the one who can forge it for me. The Atlas can't suspect what I'm up to, so make sure you're not seen. Oh, is that what this metal is? I found it when I was there earlier. Here, you can have it. Nice to see that you're as skilled as you look. I'm making the right choice to become more like you. fine to me. I don't know why you're trying to change. Just as you were destined to be the Castiz, I am destined for this. I just know it. Hmm. 
Humans in Atlantis are lucky to have someone like you fighting for them. You'll make a great leader. I'm glad you understand. Still, all you have is raw adamant. Until I take it to a skilled blacksmith so he can forge an Isu device from the adamant. Well, you know where to find the Castes when you need her. The forging takes time. What we do next will change Atlantis irreversibly. You should make sure you complete all your duties as the Castes before meeting me at the Doma of Atlas. Okay. Now the time for you the questions. This is fine, there's still the Olympian people. Hey, what's this? They said the name of an actual person. I can't do the voice. Yeah, I can't do the voice. Yeah. Oh. oh, this next one's going to be pretty easy. You're right. Mm, that's pretty cool. Oh, you can hear me. Oh. Mm. You know there's clues underneath the thing right there. Oh. Yeah, well, those are for if you play the game the uh, way I'm not playing. <coughs> no, there's, you choose it at the beginning of the game. Since I preferred the old way of playing it, I played... Uh. Is Azais a physician and an Archon? I saw me yesterday. He told me I'll be able to go home soon. Ah, uh, what was I saying? Ah, you're yeah, not that important. I remember now. Not that, not that important. What have I missed? What must I do? Azais? You have your hands full. Vigastis, you're a welcome sight. The only one I've had in some time. So many sick. I'm surprised that anything can spread in a place as advanced as this. Oh, it's shocking. Nothing I have tried will cure the sick or stop the pathogen spreading. I've lost so many already. You seem really worried. Have you ever seen a sickness like this before? No. There are many odd phenomena during this cycle. Plant dying, strange insects and animal attacks. I worry about what this could signify. When did you first notice people were getting sick? At the start of this cycle. It began quite slowly and I didn't think much of it. But then the cases grew rapidly day by day. The more that fell sick, the faster the pathogen spread. Don't worry. We'll find a way to stop the sickness. Tell me what you need. Well, there was a device being worked on by a scientist named Consus. Its intention was to rapidly heal injuries and eradicate disease. Was? His device is missing. Scientists here have tried to replicate it based on the schematics, but it's still in the experimental phase. 
And it hasn't been tested on humans. So it may not work. <laughs> That's not the biggest issue. Poseidon has outlawed the use of our technology on humans. I fear that if we don't act quickly, the pathogen will spread across Atlantis. If you think this healing device can help the sick, sure, I've got the device. I'll make sure that you have it. The wisdom of an issue, but the compassion of a human. You were a good choice for the Gustis. You'll find the device in one of the issue laboratories in the Consus archive. Yeah, I've already found the device. It's uh, it's like the Shroud of Turin. It's the same. It's the same type of um device that. Oh, it's not that. Uh, yeah, it's this one. Oh, that is the device. But the device is the same type of device. In quote here, there was you. There was the basis of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. It was the Isu artifact of the game. I mean, other than the armor of Athena. Or the Raymond for whatever the hell the, the special female armor is called in that game. I've brought the uh, glowing cloth you've asked for. It's a nanotech matter regenerator, in fact, but you have it. I can't believe it. Now then, let's see what this thing can do. Asais, what the fuck did you do? I thought I had calibrated correctly. Oh no, what have I done? I killed this poor human. The device doesn't work and you stole it against Poseidon's laws. What do we do now? What are we doing? Uh, do we just... This device is your only chance of stopping the sickness. You need to keep trying. Yes, you're right. Not trying will just mean more innocent lives are lost. I think if I make some adjustments, I can get it to function on humans correctly. Everyone seems to be looking much better. Well, almost everyone. The device still needs work, but it has incredible potential. Poseidon won't be happy that we broke his law, but I'm glad you were the one to do it and not me. In any case, I'm eternally grateful for your help. Thank you. Okay. That was quick. That's one Argon helped. I hope they're not all this intense. And it's ten o'clock. Oops, I did not mean to do that. All I mean to do was scroll over the damn thing. Okay, now which one is the next? Is it you, Rebel Scum? Yep. That way. This is it. Yes. Yes, my dear Cassandra, it is.
Sorry, I was just trying to push down on the button. I don't remember how to go faster. Can't BB dive this down. Why? Nope. Nope. Must be Amphiris. Why so many guards? The fuck is he doing? Ooh, I'm gonna enjoy kicking your ass. Let her pass. <laughs> Amphiris, if this is how you treat humans, I can see why you need so many gods. These aren't humans. They are animals. An animal should be in cages. I'm sure everything you do isn't without reason. But if you didn't call them animals, you might get a better reaction. A human did this to me while I slept. When they came to kill me, I survived. But they slaughtered my daughter like an animal. Humans don't act with logic or reason. Good or bad, they are driven by a will to survive. A trait we implanted to ensure efficiency. But that will become a kindled flame of insurrection. You led a rebellion yourself in Elysium. So I know you understand. If we don't act, the city will burn, and many more lives will be lost. I don't see an army marching on Poseidon. This one said they plan to launch an attack. Someone needs to destroy the resistance before that happens. That's not a small request. Despite what you think, all the humans aren't a threat. It is the only path I see. But you are the Dicastis. Only you can choose the correct course of action. Killing people will just make the fire spread faster. Now, if we destroy their supplies and their weapons, they can't oppose the issue. I admire your optimism. But I fear it would not be enough. However, it's your decision to make. Just leave it to me. I'll send a message they won't forget. Very well. You'll find the traitorous humans at an abandoned farmstead. Return to me when the situation is resolved. Oh? Okay, I'll be honest. I expected to see a bloodthirsty fella be soon. But, uh, one who's bloodthirsty for the sake of being bloodthirsty. Not like I'm gonna kill them, uh, kill them all because they killed my daughter. How was that? This is a restricted area. Best stay out of sight. Yep. No. I can't wait to score my own. Are you sure? What's happening, Omesh? No, you, you don't don't survive this. <sighs> you stand no chance. It 
It'll be hard to form a resistance if they have no supplies. I'm pretty sure that once I transition from these weights, the flowers, oh wait, I'm wrong. I like solid snake. I don't know why I said that, just, it just popped into my head. See the one that's talking. Vicastis, I'm glad to see you return safely. I almost considered sending a regiment of my guard after you. That would have been overkill. You can never be too careful when dealing with violent humans. Come, tell me, has the resistance been quashed? I destroyed their supplies and equipment. You believed you saved lives by being merciful. But the truth is that more will die in the end. Hmm. I promise you, they're no threat. You underestimate them. Yes, you've taken their means of striking now. But they will regroup and find more weapons. All you have done is delay the inevitable. One more Archon to go. Maybe I should just do their jobs, too. Huh. And the last Archon... Oh, there's not. Oh, wait. Yeah, at least, at least take the long way. Yeah. I, I did that. Pretty sure it's close enough. Oh look, you happen to be a dog right here. Is this some sort of symposium? Or amphitheater? Maybe I'm thinking of amphitheater, not symposium. Symposium. I wonder if this one's gonna be the chicken type. An arena seems like a strange place to find an Archon. Oh, well, maybe this is the bloodthirsty Archon I'm looking for.
Oh, he's a drunkard. Ah, oh, the guy stays. Thank the stars. Atlas I was beginning said you to lose all hope. You don't understand the responsibility on my shoulders. It's my job to concoct entertainment for the masses. But I fear the crowd have grown bored of my grand spectacles. I've seen some good plays. And some bad ones. We need more than a simple play. If the audience leave my shows bored and restless, who knows what they'll start plotting? You think they'll become violent? My purpose is to keep them preoccupied so they can't be violent. Trying to distract people from their problems will only work for so long. I misspoke. I've seen what these humans are capable of, given the chance. I'm not distracting them, merely keeping them happy. So give the people what they want. What they want, yes. Yes! I can hear the cheers now! The legendary Dicastis Cassandra takes on Atlantis's finest warriors! You must take part in my next event! Sounds like a Pangration. I can definitely help with that. Not exactly. But I was inspired by your efforts in Elise. I know you'll do an exemplary job entertaining the crowds as you did then. If we pull this off, we'll be the talk of the city! It's worth a try. Hey! Well Wait, what's this ability that I currently have? Yeah, I know next to nothing about some of these abilities. Oh. I didn't realize it. In fact, it's clued in right there on the map. It says, kills Tulu, two of the weak guards with arrows. So you don't forget and fail the objective. I forgot and failed the objective. I don't know what the objective was, so. <laughs> oh, I think all of these are made with the PC version. Or the pictures. I don't worry, we'll go in and we'll skip everything up to the fight. Oh, we'll skip most things. Out of my face. It's worth a try. Welcome one, welcome all to yet another miraculous show here in our beloved city. Tonight we have a very special guest. Belvicat Steve of Atlantis is here to entertain you. Our hero's first talent comes from the vault of Atlantis itself. Trying to because overcome the power of the Atlantean God? Let's find out! All right, Cassandra. Be entertaining. That's what he said. Oh, wow! Oh, that was thrilling! What a display! Yeah! <laughs> 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 
Nota Pangration. Это тут это ты. Our valiant heroes next challenge fast approaches. A champion bested by none in the city. No mercy, no guilt. Will this be too much for even the Dicasis to overcome? The champion has been bested. Our mighty Vicastis is victorious, and the crowd have spoken. But will she show mercy, or will she spill the blood we want? If you don't appease the crowd, I fear what Gadiros will do. It was an honor. To fight you, Dicastis. You don't deserve to die just for losing. Our merciful Dicastis has passed judgment. But do not dismay. Our champion lives to fight another day for you, the audience. And here we are, the end of today's event. Next to face our Dicastis' judgment. The very scum that taints our city. By the gods, what is this? For the good of Atlantis, today bear witness to the guilty and condemned given one final chance at redemption. Look. They will be honored to die at the hands of our guest. I don't know what to do. I mean, my gut tells me to execute them, but... Justice it is. If they're criminals, then this has to be done. Let the slaughter commence! Punish it. What a show! What a show! The people seemed entertained. And why wouldn't they be? You put on a performance for the ages. 
If this kind of entertainment keeps the peace, then maybe it has value. I know the game, Simbarbaric, but sometimes we must feed the primitive beast within to keep it dormant. Now, I must begin preparing for my next great event. Thank you for your help, Vikastis. You made a good point, though. Yeah, I'm um, blaming for it. Uh, no way today. Now we're going back to Atlas. We are indeed going back to Atlas. I get it. Knowledge. The sixth sense is knowledge. It's just not knowing something. It's oh, it's, it's just not the idea of something. It's uh, understanding the concept behind it. Like for example, I know um, climate change, but do I know the concepts behind climate change? Nope. <laughs> Oh, maybe, maybe climate change was the wrong idea, but a wrong thing to say, but it was the first thing that came to mind. Literally, first thing that came to mind. I was gonna say something, now I can't remember. Stupid tank. Oh, were there so many guards last time I was here? Oh, maybe I should have jumped off the roof. Off the roof. Huh. You know that ring I mentioned in the sky, I think it was last episode. Maybe this is like a representation of it. Like you a protective shield. Oh, that's not good. Vikastis, welcome back. I'm glad you could be here to witness this momentous occasion. Why are the Archons in chains? I invited my dear siblings here for one final lesson in leadership. It looks like an execution to me. Every experience in life should be a lesson, including death. You've been to the underworld, so I know you understand what these fools do not. Careful, Atlas. I am the Vikastis. If anyone is passing judgment here, it's me. Don't presume to think you can tell me what to do. The authority of your position doesn't extend to my palace. You're going to murder your brothers? For what? For order, for peace, for Atlantis. For Atlas, you mean. I am the rightful heir to Atlantis. I should be the Vikastis. I cannot defy Poseidon's will, but these fools don't deserve their power. I'll be a better Archon in their stead. Once Poseidon finds out what you've done, he won't let you get away with it. That is our way. The way of progress. You are not one of us. 
I've seen your compassion to those who dwell in this city. Perhaps our ways are not as perfect as Poseidon thinks they are. Parents do what they think is best, but it doesn't mean they're always right. We have to look after each other, no matter what we're told. Wise, Dicastis. I respect your decision. For the moment. So what now? If you're going to one day rule the city, Cassandra, you're going to have to learn a very important lesson. That's what I get for helping you? A lecture? Just some words of advice. Nothing in Atlantis is what it seems at face value. This city is old, and those that call it home are even older. You have helped me, Dicastis. And for that, you have my thanks. This isn't over, Atlas. On the contrary, I'm done here. Hmm. Oh, wait. I thought I was at the level one. Seventy one, I mean. Huh. Now, what the hell quest do we have next? Get blood in your eyes. Fantastic. Okay, on the Wait, how long are we going for? Ah, long enough for me to end the video. So, um. But up, but up, bye. I actually love saying that. I just get embarrassed to say it like that. Anyway, bye bye now.